Hello there, I'm Balkasem Musuni, part of the EMEA Texas organization at Red Hat. So while there are many CentOS replacements available, migrating to the Red Hat Enterprise Linux, or RHEL to use the acronym, is the most straightforward alternative. Because simply, CentOS users can continue using many of the same user-friendly features by migrating to RHEL, minimizing the amount of retraining needed, and at the same time, rely on the world's leading enterprise Linux server operating systems that comes with managed services, developer resources, long-term support, access to an extensive partner ecosystem, as well as security certification, among many other benefits. And in that context, automation is essential for such migration and upgrade to the latest version of RHEL, as it ensures a seamless and consistent and efficient transition by minimizing human error, reducing downtime, but also enabling scalable management across various environments. And RHEL, in combination with the Ansible Automation Platform, is uniquely positioned here to orchestrate your CentOS to RHEL migration, but also the post install day two workloads, helping to boost operational efficiency and deploy RHEL workloads at scale anywhere, as well as embrace operation as code by using observed IT events and apply rules to autonomously remediate issues, maintain control and auditability with less manual intervention, which means better business value outcomes, such as faster time to market, as well as cost and risk reduction. Talking about business value, we have seen in average only eight months to pay back investing on the Ansible automation platform based on the latest IDC white paper on that domain from this year. And this approach will not just better equip you to address your today needs, but also prepare you for the future of IT, such as the AI adoption. So with that, I would like to thank you very much for your attention and looking forward to work with you as part of your CentOS transition. Thank you.